Oh, holy cow, here comes a bunch of them. Good afternoon guys. It is another day out here dove hunting. I'm hunting a cut millet field. I'm in some bordering corn here, just a couple rows, and there are doves everywhere already. I just got off work and got about an hour and a half, maybe two hours to hunt. I don't think it's gonna take that long, honestly. <laughs> As I've been setting up, all I did was put my teal mojo out right there, out in this cut millet, and you can see they're all flying all over. So I'm gonna shut up and get ready to shoot. Oh, got to get the miss out. Oh, holy cow, here comes a bunch of them. Look at that. Let them spin back around here. Just had to get the miss out. Holy cow. There's a ton of does. Not really sure how I missed that one either, but That'll happen. Here they come. Here they come. Yeah, see, I want them closer than that. That's a pretty good shot. There's one. Watch him. First one down. I passed up a ton of shots already. Look at, I mean, they're just black covering this. Okay, I'm gonna just go get this guy. Here we are. No band. Here we go, here we go, come on. Swing this way, dude. Oh wow, holy cow. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> They're too close. They are too close, holy crap. Ah. <sighs> These doves are decoying way too close. <laughs> This is nuts. Here we go. Got that one. Oh, here we go. There we go. There's three. Here's number four, hopefully. Four. That's how you turn it around. Three doves the quick way right there. <laughs> That's four down. I've only been out here like 10 minutes. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> With how close these things are coming, I wish I would have thrown in my improved cylinder. I mean, it's not impossible to hit them with a modified, but I mean, they're 10 yards or closer. It's, it's a little tough to get on them. <laughs> improved would be a lot easier. But holy cow, so far so good. We've got four in the bag. Here's one. There we go, five. He came in nice. Right there. There we go. There he is, number six. I am loving this 28 gauge. This thing is sweet. I can't wait to put it on some teal this weekend. Been thinking about this all day after work. Coming out, getting on some doves here on this cup millet field. Yo, here we go, come on, keep coming, keep coming. There we go. Oh, number seven. There we go. Got one. No jewelry. Number eight. Oh, here we go. Here we go, come on. Got him. Oh, I could shot him. I could shoot this guy right here. Ten. There he is. <sighs> Numero ten. And we've got more flocks coming. This is nuts. This is such a blast. Come on, swing around, swing around. Got one. Got one, he's gonna be right above me. Holy crap. That's <laughs> yeah, probably a good thing I didn't shoot because he came 
right here. He would have been just a ball of feathers. Here's a couple. There. Couldn't hit the first one. I've had a couple like that. Got him though. Number 12. Got one coming. Got one coming. Keep coming. There we go. 13. Oh, that was. There we go. Two more to go. Got a pair. Got one. Oh. All right, one more to go. Well, it started off really hot and heavy. I mean, I showed up and there were just birds everywhere. And obviously as I kept shooting, that kind of scared them off further and further. Ended with 14, one shy. And it's not because of lack of birds. It was because I missed some opportunities. You know, I didn't shoot as well as I should have. That's just how it goes. You know, that's hunting. So 14 doves on the day though, that is nothing to scoff at. That's a heck of a day really good day actually so i'm gonna have a ton of dove poppers now and uh this cut millet filled this is what they wanted i mean i you know i'd pick up some doves and there was millet popping out of their mouth so they've been feeding on this stuff constantly they love it i don't know if i'll get back out on some doves but this was a heck of a way to end it if this was my last dove hunt of the year 14 doves but that is all i have for you guys today thank you so much for watching like and subscribe and be sure to go out there and support those conservation organizations ducks unlimited duck waterfowl pheasants forever it doesn't matter there is one out there for you and they do a ton of good work for the hunters for the general public for the animals for everyone so be sure to go out there and support them we will catch you out there guys see ya